Well, let's jump into the gene pool, shall we? I do see a drone. I mean, a Democrat from Chevy Chase, Maryland, the great WMAL. Larry, let me ask you a question before you ask me. May I? Yeah, absolutely. It's your show. What is it like uh, living in a town named after a comedian? You know what? That, that's been a topic of conversation uh, in the, the local watering holes, uh, whether or not this place was named after uh, him or whether he took the name uh, because he wanted to have a fine uh, name named after a good, solid, liberal community. Well, now, uh, Chevy Chase, is that located next to Carrot Top? Uh, no, as a matter of fact, it's not. Around the corner from Pauly Shore? <laughs> no. No, it's not, there's nothing funny about living here. It's very serious uh, because people here mostly have a vision. Yes, I know. Liberals are very, very serious all the time. As a matter of fact, they're miserable, as, as best I can tell. But go ahead, Larry. You had a question. You're a Democrat. Well, actually, or a statement. I... I just wanted to simply point out, Mark... Wait a minute, I want to make you more comfortable. May I make you more comfortable? Please do. Go ahead, hit that song. Go ahead, Larry. Country's going to hell, the socialists are taking over. Uh, Larry's a happy man. Go ahead, Larry, lower it a little. Mark, I I wanted to, to point out something that's fairly obvious. It was inevitable that the free market system would fail. Uh, human beings tend to be greedy at their core, and it was inevitable that this this, this land, this utopian uh, uh, country that you painted to be, was inevitably going to fail. Now we have been blessed by having this amazing man with a vision for the future uh, to be elected our president, and uh, and you need to you need to t- heed. Uh, Which bureaucracy do you work for, sir? Which, uh, I I would rather not say. Uh, uh, the, which bureaucracy do you work for, sir? I, I work uh, for the Department of Energy. How did I know that you were a bureaucrat? More music, please. Go. And uh, so far, you guys at the Department of Energy have produced exactly nothing. Louder. Well, Let's dance well, along, Larry. What do you that, do there at the Department of Energy? Do you produce energy? Uh, no, I do not produce energy. Well, shouldn't no, it be called the Department of No Energy? Louder. Actually, uh, we actually lead the lead, lead the energy producing up to uh, the big oil companies. So, what does the Department the of Energy do? I said it should be called the Department of No Energy. Well, we, we like act- the Department of Education should be the Department of Illiteracy. Well, uh, Pre- President Obama actually has Hit a plan. It. I know, the Marxist always has a plan. Let me ask you, is it a five-year plan? Just curious. Louder. Well, I, I think it's plan. It's going to take some time to clean up President Bush's mess. Oh, yes. You know how those Bushes are. You know how free enterprise is. You know how those businessmen are. Right, Larry? Louder. I, I, so you work I, I, at a department, sir, that produces no energy, and it's called the Department of Energy. You live in a town that's called Chevy Chase that's named after a comedian. Life must be really crappy for you. That, that is true. It's about ready to get better, Mark, under President Obama. Life oh, yes, I life. know. Oh, the great Obama. Life oh, yes. Get better. The great like, Obama. Hold on now. I'm helping you out, brother. The great Obama. It's about to get better. You know why, Larry? Why is that, Mark? Less energy, smaller private sector, bigger government. Makes Larry happy. Louder. So, Larry, will you do me a favor when you go to work tomorrow? Sure. Actually, we have tomorrow off. What's why? What's tomorrow? Well, they they've implemented a new policy. Uh, it's part of the four day work week uh, plan, and uh, it, it's uh, it's. Oh, a this is great! Four week. Oh, I love this. It, it's fantastic, actually. It really is. And, we should uh, all yeah. work for the mothership. Yeah, it's fantastic. Uh, you, uh, it's a flex schedule, and uh, and uh, oh, hopefully, geez. hopefully, all government agencies will uh, uh, will ha- we help out traffic in the D.C. area. Oh, I know, it's a good thing. Just work four days. The rest of us work six. That's a good thing, right, Larry? Yeah, I mean, it's it's. Uh, I mean, if you've ever been to France, Mark, uh, you you can appreciate the four day work week. Uh, I've spent a couple of uh, yeah. If you've ever before. been to Zimbabwe, you can appreciate the no work day. Louder. How's that working over there? Well, I have to tell you, though, Mark... How many bureaucrats are there at the Department of Energy, honestly? 
Uh, I, I don't, uh, I don't, I don't keep a running count. Well, uh, of course you don't keep a running count. You, you have four days, you only work. Let me ask you this. Just sure. give me, uh, give me a baseball park figure. Give me a ballpark figure. Uh, I would say there's probably in the neighborhood of 1,200 employees there. Oh, there's got to be more than that at the Department of Energy? Uh, in, in the building that I work in. There's You've got that really big building that looks like it has a moat. Isn't that the one? Up on stilts? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I guess it could be described that way. Don't you know where you work, sir? I, I do, I do. Um, it's like uh, they're getting ready for the big flood. But if I make it back to my, my original point. Yes, get back to your original point that uh, the free market sucks and uh, government's great and you work four days. Exactly. At but a Department of Energy that doesn't produce energy. But President Obama... Like the, the, pals, the Department of Housing and Urban Development. It doesn't produce housing or urban development. President Obama has a, has a vision. All right, sir, sir you, sound like, you sound like a parrot. President Obama... May I have a cracker? President Obama. President Obama. First of all, why don't you call him what I call him, in all due respect to the man? There was a time he didn't like his middle name. I called him Millhouse. Say it. Millhouse, say it. I, I, I actually, I, I find that disrespectful, uh, considering that he's... Uh... I find it very respectful. Thank you. <laughs> well, I, I, I will tell you... Now, let me ask you something. What do you do at the uh, Department of No Energy? Um, I work in the, the technology department, but I... I Wait a minute. Hold to... on now. Slow down. You want, you're you like hit and run. You work in the technology division. Th that is correct. What does the technology division at the Department of Energy do? Figure out more uh, paper shredders? You get the newer paper shredders so you can destroy uh, uh, the applications that are sent there to do more drilling? Is that what the uh, Department of Technology does? Louder. Uh, we... We we have our marching orders and and but it doesn't involve anything that you just mentioned. And what do we do in the division of technology? Uh, most obviously uh, three days a week we don't do anything. But the four that you're there, what do you do? I I'm a uh, I'm a database administrator. Oh, you're a computer guy. Yeah, but but Mark did. I, I not go to, ahead, not President to, Obama. Digress. Go ahead. I, I think once he once he has an opportunity to to implement some of his policies, he's gonna he's gonna have an opportunity to right some horrible wrongs that have been done over the last several years. Uh, the, the free market system, as I mentioned, cannot sustain itself, but surely because human beings are greedy. Sir, let me let me explain something. Nobody's government. greedier, sir. Nobody's greedier than the government bureaucrat. Nobody's greedier than the uh, than the politician in Washington D.C. Because all they ever think about is materialism, how to, how to steal it from somebody else. Greed, my friend, is what the socialist is. In the private well, sector, hold on now, in the private sector, you can be greedy. You can be greedy, and you know what? That greed turns into what? Wealth creation and job creation. See, if there weren't a bunch of people like me out here, sir, who would pay your salary? Well, well Mark, what, thank you for uh, Thank you very much. That's enough. Kill, uh, kill the call. Kill the music. I'm getting ahead.